Hey everybody, Dr. Nelson here. Uh, this is a video about median. So what we're gonna do is for the first two pages, you're gonna take notes with me, and then you have a chance to pause the video and try some problems on your own, and then at the end you can see how you did. All right, so what exactly is the median value? Well, the median value is, is just a fancy way of saying the middle value, all right? But kind of the textbook definition is, the median is the middle number in a sorted list of numbers. So let's write that down. It's the middle number, in a sorted list of numbers. All right, now there's two key words here. The first one is middle, all right? And then the second one is sorted, all right? So the steps to find the, the median is you first have to put the numbers in order from least to greatest. So we'll say order numbers from least to greatest. So for example, over here, we have the numbers two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. They're already um, in order from least to greatest. And then the, the last part is find the middle number. Find the middle number. And for some problems, it's quite easy. And for some, it's a little more difficult. So for this one, to find the middle number, what I like to do is I like to cross off numbers at the end, one at a time. So cross off the two and the nine, and then the four and the eight, and then the five and the seven. And if you notice, we have one number left over in the middle, and that's six. So six would be the middle point or the median of this number set. All right, so let's turn the page. Let's try a few more. And they do get a little more challenging than that, but, but, but not much, all right? So here, for example, one, we have the numbers 12, 10, 22, 30, and eight. So step one, we need to put them in order from least to greatest, right? So the least number is eight, followed by 10, and then 12, and then 22, and then finally 30. Now, let me give you a little hint. Anytime you have an odd number of, of numbers, it's easy because there'll be one exact answer for the median. So here, if you notice, the middle number is going to be 12. So that's going to be our, med our median value of this data set. Again, I could cross off the 8 and the 30, and then the 10 and the 22. And what's left over is just the middle number, which is 12. Now, this one over here, notice there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 numbers. This one is a little bit more challenging, but first things first, let's put the numbers in order from least to greatest. So that's going to be four is our least. And then we have the number eight. And it looks like number 10 is going to be next. And then 11 is next biggest. And then 14. And then finally 100. All right, now notice this time we have six numbers, right? We have one, two, three, four, five, and six. So the middle of that is actually going to be right here, right? Okay. And right there is not a number. So what you do, again, is you work yourself uh, to the middle. So I'm going to cross off the 8 and then the 14 also. But now we're left with these two. And what you do is you have to find the average or the mean of those two numbers. So I'm going to go with uh, 10 plus 11 and then divide it by 2 to get the average. So that's going to be 21 divided by 2. So our middle number is going to be 10.5 and that's going to be the, the median value. All right. So again, when you have an odd number of numbers, it's easy. It's just, it's gonna be one exact number. But when you have an even amount, you have to take the average of the middle two numbers to get the median. All right, so why don't you pause the video and try the your turn now problems. And when you're done, hit play, you can see how you did. All right, good luck. All right, welcome back. Let's see how you do this practice problem. So here you have to find the median value of the data set we're talking about the points scored by the New England Patriots. So notice we have seven games. So step number one is to put the numbers in order from least to greatest. So it looks like the smallest number we have is nine. So that's gonna be our first one. So nine, and then followed by 20. And personally, I like to cross them off when I'm done. So nine is done, and then 20 is, is done. And the next number looks like it's 24, it's next smallest, so 24. And then we have 28. 
and then 30. Followed by 35. And then finally 42 is our, is our largest. All right, so step number one is put the numbers in order from least to greatest. Now, let's count the, how, many, how many games we have. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven games, which makes this a little bit easier because we're gonna have this one exact number for our median. So I'm gonna actually use a different color to make it a little more obvious. So I'm gonna cross off the ends. So I'm gonna cross off the nine, the 42, and then the 20 and 35, the 24 and 30, and what's left over right here, 28, that is the median value for our answer. All right, how'd you do?